Mothers in Crisis, we're celebrating 25 years of service. For those of you that don't know, Mothers in Crisis is a non-profit, grassroots, community-based organization that I founded back in 1991, and we're celebrating 25 years this April, and as a result, we've been talking to those whose lives have been impacted by Mothers in Crisis, and we have with us another dear friend of the ministry, none other than Miss Betty Hadley. How are you? Doing great. Great, it's so great to see you. I've, you. I've just really been enjoying catching up with everybody. Some people I hadn't seen in years. <laughs> just to talk about Mothers in Crisis and, and how Mothers in Crisis had an impact on your life and your family. So why don't you just look into the camera and just share your own story. Okay. I came to Mothers in Crisis through my son, Andrew Hale. Uh, my son always come home and I always talk about Mothers in Crisis. So I said, well, let me go up here and see what's going on, why he's so interested in going up here. And uh, when I went, I enjoyed what I seen because they always was doing things for the kids in the community. They had the outreach program. They had the food ministry and another program they had around Christmas time when they would give out gifts. So I, I went to see what was going on and my children was really enjoyed. Matter of fact, my son played the drums. Yes, <laughs> he did. And he here. was really good too. Yes, yes. And <laughs> yes. then my daughter Ashley joined the dance ministry. So mm -hmm. it was just a great impact until I just came and joined you all for about five years. Yeah, I think, about yeah. Five years. Sir. So, yes. Yeah, so it was really a good impact. And, um, it kept the kids busy. You know, I was a, um, a single parent working 16, sometimes 18 hours. Mm -hmm. And it was always something to do at Mothers in Crisis. On Friday nights, y'all was doing yes. things for the kids, yes. having fish fries and doing all things. So I just appreciate you. Everything oh. that you did for the community, everything that you um, impacted me and my kids. And I know that they love you so much. And I just Amen. Tell you, you. Love you. God bless you. And we love you. And we love, Amen. love, love, love Andrew, his memory. Yes. And also Ashley, and we know that he's resting in peace in the bosom of Jesus. Jesus. Amen. Amen. So, so as you see, you know, she talked from the perspective of a mother whose children were impacted by kids in yes. partnership. We had to become a full service family organization mm -hmm. because it wasn't just about that one person. It's always about everyone that makes up the family. So I just want to say thank God for you. Hey, you guys, we're going to have a soiree on April the 15th. That's that Friday night. We're going to have a band right here. We want you to come back to all of the festivities on that Saturday. We're going to have Hope 2.0 seminar. We're bringing in an international missionary, Dr. Patricia Bailey. And then Sunday, April the 17th, we're going to have our reunion service. Because Mothers in Crisis, now we're taking it to the next level. We're spreading hope around the world. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. <laughs>